A Petoskey-based company is investing $2 million into manufacturing disposable medical gowns. Petoskey Plastics originally began creating these gowns at the start of the pandemic. Three years later, they're looking to make 24 million gowns every year. Up North Live's Josh Kerman takes a look at how this all started. Petoskey Plastics always had a medical division, but before the pandemic, they haven't done anything quite like this. I can't say that PPE was on a, quite on a radar yet. Uh, certainly the pandemic... Uh, brought it to our attention and, and definitely educated us on, you know, what what a disposable PE gown is, what it's used for, and, and you know, obviously the the need of a domestic source for them uh, long term. Disposable PE gowns were used for just about everything during the pandemic. And when COVID ramped up in 2020, hospitals across the country were struggling to find personal protective equipment within the U.S. The team at McLaren in Northern Michigan reached out to Petoskey Plastics to see if they could help. And at the time, we were actually looking for thermometer covers. And uh, they re we realized they couldn't make those, but they were able to make plastic gowns. And so we went through a very rapid prototyping process. And within the course of five or six days, we went from making the call to what can you do all the way through to having the first prototypes and being able to use them. And those prototypes from McLaren were just the beginning. During the time of the pandemic, just being a part of a solution, there was such a, a desperate need um, for, for the gowns and, and PPE. And and, and it was great to be, you know, be part of a business that could step up and, and, and help out. Uh, our phones were, you know, ringing off the, the hook back then. Uh, we supplied all the major hospitals in Michigan and, and several nationally. Um, but yeah, it's, uh, that was exciting to be able to help. Keysweater says they've allotted 10,000 square feet in their Petoskey factory for the new gown making machines. The plan is to have two in the factory by 2024, which will mean 25 new jobs for packers and operators. And Keysweater says expanding production more in the future is a real possibility. In Emmett County, Josh Kerman, Up North Live News. The first of the two machines is up and running at the factory now, pumping out 2 million gowns every month. The team at Petoskey Plastics expects the second machine to be up and running in early 2024.